pants, jacket ain't pleather, pal. You owe me 500 bucks. The next time I shoot, you won't be looking at paint on your jacket. Come after me any way you want, any direction you choose. But don't you dare use Michael to do it. Well, Michael and I were just having a conversation, right? Michael. And I'm surprised, I gotta say, that you'd object after all your big speeches about how welcome I am to take my place in your family. Why would you have a problem with me talking to my brother? If I got the quote right. If you don't want to kill me, Jason, then don't. You protected Michael, that counts with me, but it's not a free pass. This is how easy it would be for you to die. That goes both ways, Jason. And my gun doesn't shoot paint. Why bring Jason into this? Can you leave us alone? Well, this is about me. I should be able to hear it. Well, what did I just say? Look, if you ever want to talk to me, you know where to find me. My door's open. Go! Kid's been through hell and back. His mother and I are just trying to get him back on track. It is needing you to pressure him. If Michael's under any pressure, it's definitely not coming from me. Okay, you know what? You, you, I'm sure you hear good intentions. I don't think you're here as a cop. It's very difficult to tell. Either way, I, I, don't, I believe you don't mean harm to him. But do you understand the damage that you could cause? Right. Right, because it's always the other people who cause harm. Right, Sonny? It's never you. I mean, you're just, you're just this poor, misunderstood guy trying to be a good dad. That's your story and you're sticking to it. Enabled by a whole mess of people dedicated to perpetuating the lie. Well, you know what? Michael's old enough now that he's going to see through the fairy tale and see exactly what it is. And I'm going to help that process along, whether it fits into your plans or not. Is this really what we've come to, Jason? Huh? Messages do go both ways. I could have shot you, but I didn't and I won't. So come at me with all the bullets, artillery, paint that you want. I'm not shooting back. I just wish you weren't doing this. What, going after Sonny? After what he did to my sister? What's it going to take for you to let it go? Let it go? Really? That's your advice? Let it go? Could you let it go if it was Carly or Emily? Both of us know it, but I'm the only one saying it. Sonny's the guilty party here, not Mike. You need to understand that Sonny's tied to everybody that I care about, and he's not going down. I'm not going to let it happen, Johnny. You keep pushing me. I'm going to push back. What you need to do is stay out of what doesn't concern you. Oh, oh no, but, but I am concerned about Michael. The pressure of not telling what happened with Claudia is wrecking him. Don't you see that? Or is he just collateral damage and a bigger service to you? Why can't you just take yes for an answer? You're getting exactly what you want. I'm standing trial for Claudia's murder. And it's up to your precious justice system to do what they want with me. But, I, I, you know, Michael just needs to stay out of it. Michael's the one who saw you kill Claudia. It's the only reason why he'd be so obvious about shutting him up. He wasn't there. Okay, you want to tell you what happened? I'll tell you what happened. When I killed Claudia, I found the uh, car she had stolen from the hotel, abandoned on the side of the road. Uh, and then I saw tracks leading up to a cabin. When I got there, Carly and Claudia were there. Carly had just had her baby. Claudia was stealing the baby. Now, Carly couldn't stop her because it was a difficult labor, stressful night. So I did what I had to do, didn't want to. I killed Claudia. Now, at that point, we weren't having, you know, a lot of problems. I mean, but any normal marriage has, right? We could have worked through it. What I did not calculate was my own strength. I hit her. I hit her. I hit her hard. That part was an accident, saving 
Carly and the baby. That was justified. So help me God. If he gets it in his head that he wants to blow the case wide open, no guard is going to stop him. Maybe we should get him out of the country. Exactly. What I want you to do is I want you and Sam to take him to the island until the trial's over. Okay, what about Carly? Don't worry about Carly. I'm going to handle Carly. I'm having dinner with her tonight at the Metro Court. Reverting back to old patterns. I see. Well, that, that didn't take very long, did it? What? You know, I, uh... thought this place was just a front, but you actually look like you know what you're doing. Well, believe it or not, my father knows his way around a car engine. It's one of the few harmless things he taught me. Yeah, I don't think Sonny would be much help in that department. He probably wouldn't want to get oil on his suit. My mother, on the other hand, she was... Pretty fierce under the hood of a car, but man, you probably already know that. Probably good to leave your mother out of our topics of conversation, huh? Yeah, it's a, it's a good idea. Still trying to wrap my head around this whole damn thing. Sonny being your father and all? Yeah, one of life's practical jokes. Listen, uh, do you have a minute? I wonder if I could ask you some questions about the aftermath of Claudia's death. Yeah, I'm happy to help in any way I can. Yeah, when you were coming and going from Sonny's house or dealing with Jason, did, did you hear anything that puts Sonny at the cabin? No. <laughs> Wish I had. How about uh, uh, Michael? Did, uh, did he ever tell you anything about Claudia's death? A lot of people were saying a lot of things, Dante. You might want to be more specific. Okay. Uh, did Michael imply that he had any knowledge about how Claudia well, died? Leave Michael went... alone. Okay, these, these are your dad's wishes, and you know he wants to keep you safe. No, he wants to keep me out of poor Charles so that I don't confess to killing Claudia. And you can't understand that? Well, maybe I don't want to be the screw-up who needs his dad to stand trial for. And that's not what Sonny thinks about you, you know that. Have you seen dad around Dante? Even when Dante came here to question me, yeah, dad jumped all protective. But it's like, he sees Dante as equal to him, you know? That's not how he sees me. And, and you think... Confessing to Claudia's murder is going to change all that. Well, at least I can prove that I'll stand up and, and take responsibility. Okay, look, I understand how you feel right now. There's no competition between you and Dante, okay? We need to get out of the country before everything we've done blows up in our face. Yeah, that reaction there, you being so adamant about me leaving Michael alone, that just tells me that Michael knows way more than he's saying. Don't put words in my mouth. Okay, John, then use your own words. I wouldn't be telling you anything you don't already know, all right? And you've been an eyewitness to all the hell that Michael's been through. So instead of zeroing in on him as a suspect, how about maybe approaching him as a big brother, a role model? He needs that right now. Protect him. Nobody else has. Look, I I'm not having much fun doing this. Okay, that kid it breaks my heart. The, the pain he's going through, the confusion, putting himself as this big man in front of Sonny. You know, I mean, that's why I'm trying to pursue this, okay? We got to get Michael out from underneath the influence of Sonny. Away from the lies, away from the violence, away from the, 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 the miscommunication. That's it. Sonny probably thinks I'm pegging Michael as a witness to Claudia's death and he's going to try and get him out of the country as soon as he can. That is the serial killer. He will... How can you guys babysit me on the island? Aren't you supposed to testify at death's trial? Once we get you settled, Sam and I are going to come back. Oh, and by settled, you mean jailers put in place. Okay, I, I know that you hate this, Michael, but it's for the best. We have to get you out of the country before the cops list you as a potential witness. Hey, Jason, it's Dante. I need to talk to you about Michael. Hey, 